Welcome friends. Thank you for subscribing and watching my videos. I do appreciate it. There has been some recent news here in the villages, Florida, about geological anomalies, aka sinkholes, forming. And recently there was a home that was considered unlivable here in the villages, Florida. Let's go and take a look. Welcome friends. Welcome to the villages, Florida. Thank you for subscribing. And liking my videos, I do appreciate it. As I mentioned in the, in the introduction before, there has been some recent news here in the villages, Florida, about geological anomalies. Geological anomalies are commonly known as sinkholes here. The villages will occasionally publish information about geological anomalies, but they are known to the layperson as sinkholes. And what you see here is uh, I'm in the village of Calumet Grove. And what you see there in front of you are excavating, excavating equipment and they are repairing a geological anomaly that's located here in the village of Calumet Grove. This geological anomaly looks like it's near a retention pond. And that's where most geological anomalies form, are near retention ponds or storm sewers or storm drains. Typically, these geological anomalies will form after a heavy rainstorm or after a tropical storm or after a hurricane. That's generally when these geological anomalies will form. And as you know, this is Saturday, the Saturday after Tropical Storm Debbie affected the villages, Florida. And sure enough, we had a geological anomaly form. And I thought I'd take a walk and show you what the geological anomaly looks like. The villages act very promptly when they do have geological anomalies. And what happens is the uh, rainwater will form a depression in the earth. And here is what it looks like. And you can see that there is utility lines right there. And this is what it looks like. And apparently this geological, uh, un geological anomaly has affected that home right there. That home right there has been uh, deemed in unlivable, and they do have a red tag on the front door. And the foundation of that home has deemed to be unsafe. The roof of that home has been considered to be safe. But that home has been vacated, and it's been requested by the villages that the residents vacate that home. And it is due to the geological anomaly that was formed right here. And they are in the process of repairing it. They will repair it as soon as possible. You can see this retention pond actually is fairly low in the, with the water level. I did hear in the news that a geological anomaly was formed recently, right after Tropical Storm Debbie in the Lake Sumter landing area as well. And occasionally throughout the year you will hear about these geological anomalies being formed throughout the villages. They do a very good job and they are very proactive at repairing them. But unfortunately we have a homeowner that has been displaced because the foundation of that home has been deemed to be unsafe. This is in the village of Calumet Grove here in the northern part of the villages, Florida. You can see that they do have caution tape. I'm not sure what golf course this is, but I will look it up and I'll include it in a pop-up window on this video. You can see to the south there's a large storm brewing. Welcome friends. Here you can see and you can hear the storm sewers are draining 
we still have the effects of Tropical Storm Debbie. I am in the neighborhood. And the homer, homeowner has been displaced. I will show you the street that it's on as well. The home is located on Parlange Terrace. That is where the home is located. Here in the Villages, Florida, this is in the village of Calumet Grove. And the golf course is right behind those homes. It's a very warm day today. It's a Saturday. And I did read this news article in the villagesnews.com. And I thought I would show you the location of this home. I do appreciate it. Thanks for joining. This is the home where the homer owner has been displaced and the foundation of this home has been deemed unsafe. You can see the red tag in the window. That means this home is unsafe to live in. Although it appears you don't see any visible signs of damage. They did investigate the foundation of this home and they deemed this foundation to be unsafe. They did say the roof is perfectly safe to live in. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. I do appreciate it. By the way, that direction is facing north. That direction is facing south where you see the large storm clouds. Welcome friends. Continuing with the theme of geological anomalies. This actually is the site of a geological anomaly that happened one or two years ago here in the villages, Florida. There was a hole here. You notice that the pavement has been repaired and it's next to a store, uh, storm drain. That's typically where these geological anomalies occur, is near storm drains. And it usually happens after a heavy rainfall. I did take some pictures of that a couple of years ago. And if I still have those pictures on my phone, I will include them in this video. But you notice that it's also near a retention pond here in the villages, Florida. Now I remember videoing and taking a picture, actually taking a picture. There was another, at the same time, there was also a, a depression in the earth somewhere in this area as well. And I think there is a storm drain. That storm drain somehow leads into this retention pond. I'm trying to see if I can find where that geological anomaly was a couple of years ago. It might have been in this area right here. The grass looks a little different there. But I just wanted to show you what it looks like after they repair. Thank you for watching. Thank you for subscribing. And you can see they are still watering the golf courses after Tropical Storm Debbie. These retention ponds are still full of water, pretty high. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. I do appreciate it. Have a great day, everybody. Stay safe. Thank you for watching this video regarding geological anomalies here in the villages, Florida. Please subscribe to my channel and like my video. I do appreciate it. Stay safe, everyone. Take care.